Fire. So yeah, Mr. Fire. Yeah, man. There, man. Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, I don't know what happened. The Wi Fi went down in the office now, and I have to turn back on my regular Wi Fi. That means my phone might ring again. Okay. But let's just, well, you know what I mean? Fight through with it, right? Oh, it's just, yeah. Well, yeah, this, well, this you knows... know, so it's just, it's just wrap more, wrap up everything, you know. I just yeah. want to say to everybody, yo, give thanks, you know, because it's one of them conversations that I didn't know how this was going to end. Uh, we just started talking with a, with a, with a fire lit by DMX's mm -hmm. passing. And by the conscious, um, you know, conversation of knowing that our community just doesn't speak on suicide, mental health, drugs, and uh, molestation. And we try to act like it's not us, it's them over there. And, um, you know, uh, I've seen uh, my sister be molested, um, and I stayed silent. Uh, I've seen my sister smoke crack and die, and I stayed silent. Um, you know, I've seen a lot of my friends get murdered. Um, and, uh, you know, I have not done everything I can do to really get a conversation going as to how do we avoid more black boys from being murdered? Um, and of course, suicide, you know, you know, we, we, we look at them like they're the crazy one and, um, uh, you know, we never acknowledge that people are going through things. So yeah, I just wanted to wrap this up by saying, you everybody, please, man, be very aware, be very aware of the people around you, be aware of your community. Uh, if, you know, you don't feel like um, uh, interacting with people, that's fine. But, you know, we, we're responsible for each other, man, as humans. You know, yeah. we're responsible for each other. And we want to make sure that we take care of each other. Um, Matt, take big up yourself, King. Um, you know, we want to make sure that we take care of each other, man. And so, you know, each one, teach one. Everybody take care of each other and um, take care of yourself, too, you know. Um, and so, yeah, man, I'm going to go lay down for a little while, man. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I just want to say big up and yeah, we could catch up and really um probably go go again on uh, um early next week, man. But everybody always follow muscle and uh look for the conversations that me and him have, man. And you know, they're always good conversations and stuff like that. And maybe he uh maybe he recorded this one and saved it. <laughs> yeah, it's, know, it's saved, it's on the thing there, it's right there. I just put it up yeah. on, on the feed right now because yeah, man. Again, so you guys can go back and watch it again. Yeah. Because yeah. I know with, with conversations like this, you'd usually pass by somewhere and it would be a room of women talking and stuff like that. But you don't see, it's yeah. two two things that this conversation did. You generally don't see black males talking and you generally don't see black males that's in a cool industry talking about yeah. this because we're forever cool. You understand? Right. You, nothing touches you. Nothing happens. You go on a stage, you scream your head off, you have fun. You repeat that for 700 times and we're good to go. Right. What about when you're not doing that? You right. understand? What about yeah. when you're not interviewing somebody? Yeah, a lot and of people don't, don't know, man, that, you know, I'm, I'm just as human as everybody else, you know, and I put on this. Yeah, guys, this Wall Street Fire thing is just a character. You know what I'm saying? It's a it's show. Awesome. You know, we go up there, we do this thing, but, you know, a few of you guys in here, you know, y'all don't know, y'all know Leighton, you know, and Leighton is just a human trying to, you know, as most deaf said, man, you know, I'm not a perfect man. Just trying to do the best that I can with what it is I have. And that's all it is, man. So, you know, I respect everybody, man. I love you guys. And, uh, you know, I already see tons of messages coming in and I appreciate it, man. And nice. DMX, rest in peace, man. Thank you for sparking this conversation today. DMX, um, no, oh, just to big up, Ian, big up, um, you know, and, uh, you know, what I might have said today, it might have turned some people off from me. Some people might not want to fuck with me no more. Some people might look at me as I'm the diseased kid. I'm the cancer kid. I'm the one that, you know what I'm saying, no one wants to be now, you know, around and stuff like that because cause I've gone through something and I have some trauma and that's fine. They're dealing with, they're dealing with the same thing. They, they want to push you away so they don't have to face yourself. You right. understand? Yeah, That's man. What Believe me, folks, uh, it's going to be pressure. You get around me and I see something not right, I'm going to talk about it. And we're going to address it. And we're going to talk about what's going on. And so everybody out there, man, be well. Take care of each other, man. You know, I hope that everybody gets a chance to hug somebody or at least just tell them uh, that you're thinking about them. And uh, don't wait till it's too late, man. You know, the, the weight that I feel, uh, feeling like I... I I actively participated in my sister's passing and uh, feeling like I killed my sister myself by, by staying quiet and watching so all. many of my brethren die, my best friend Dagger being murdered. Um, you know, so many of my friends going to prison 
and a lot a lot of it I feel like I personally am responsible for because I never really as an alpha male stepped in and was like yo nah that's it that's done that's dead you know we're not doing that no more and now I've got a I've got a lot of friends that are gone and a lot of uh a lot of friends that are doing time and it's because I didn't speak up and so I ask everybody yo speak up man speak up speak up you see your friends going in a direction you see them doing some whack corny gang stuff or whack corny you know selling crack to black people or whack corny black on black crime yo no change, step up step up you're like yo you corny man stop being so fucking corny you see me so but just want to tell everybody say oh, I really appreciate the conversation and yo what we'll do with it again in another week you know because sure. is a little more is a little more more I said I'm gonna feel like I feel like I feel like this would help you know yeah man I feel like this would help you know so Everybody just look forward to it, man. I just make yo, just know some loving about it now. Loving about it. And thank you. Like like Eclipse just said, he's 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 got he's got my back. Big up to everybody that's you know supporting me, man. I appreciate you. You know, Lady Anne, thank you so much for speaking again. Yeah. Uh, Junior Syria. Dangerous. Junior Dangerous, you know, everybody follow them. Um uh, Javon Glasgow, follow them, man. You know what I'm saying? Wicked conversation. Yeah, my wicked conversation. And much love everybody. I'm gonna lay down for a little while, man. I right. appreciate you. My brother. Uh, yo, thank respect. you so very much. All right? Yeah. Big man. up yourself and big up everybody in the chat. This was a conversation needed to have. We had it. Hopefully you'll join us next time. And, you know, you never know where our conversations go. This yeah, one man. went somewhere where nobody expected it to go. Not even the two of us having this conversation here. But I'll Facts. tell you something. That as a man, a big man, a 46-year-old man, I'm 100% glad it went down this road where we all felt uncomfortable to make ourselves comfortable again. You understand? Love. Yeah, man. All right. Big up, my boss. See him? Big cool. up. Everybody else, have a great night. You'll see us back on live sooner rather than later. All right? Thank you guys again for passing through. Jaja Yard Vibes, I see you. Thank you for being in there. Select a princess. I see you over there. You know what I mean? Everybody that's in there, Junior Dangerous, thank you for coming through. Everybody, this wasn't the thing here. This was not the planned conversation at all. But it needed to happen, and I'm glad it happened. So thank you, guys. You guys, if anybody's coming in late now, you could check my um, check my feed. I have the part one up, and I mean, and we're out here. Thank you, guys, again. Love, hugs, kisses, job blessing, all of that good stuff to you guys, too, all right? Big up yourself, ladies and gentlemen. Uh-oh.